In this video, I'm going to show you the best way to add cinematic bars to your video projects in Adobe Premiere Pro. Hey there, I'm Mark Brown from Editor's Keys and welcome to the video. If it's your first time on the channel, consider subscribing because we've got a whole series about how to get that cinematic look. Now, I've seen a lot of YouTube videos really giving up the wrong advice on this subject. The first bit of advice is to simply add an adjustment layer to Premiere and then use the crop tool to get down to that 2.35 to 1 aspect ratio, which is the anamorphic aspect ratio you'll see in a lot of films. And this really is the wrong way. And then the second way is people will say, download some PNG black bars and slap those on top of your footage. Now this won't work for a number of reasons, but especially if you're viewing the footage on a non 16 by nine monitor, you just won't see those black bars at all or it will crop into it completely the wrong way. So today I'm gonna to show you the right way. So let's jump straight into Premiere and let's get to it. Okay, so what you need to do is go into the sequence settings and then change the aspect ratio by changing the frame size. So as this is 4K footage, the original frame size is 3840 by 2160, which is 16 by nine. To make it the cinematic 2.35 to one ratio, which is also the anamorphic ratio, change this to 1634. And there you go, it's as simple as that. And that's the correct way to add bars. Now, if your footage is 1080p, then you want to change this to 817. Some high quality cameras that have 4K also shoot in 4096. So just change this to 1679. Now what I'll do is I'll leave a link in the description below this video to one of our blog posts which feature all of the correct aspect ratio sizes that you can put into Premiere Pro to really achieve that cinematic look the correct way. Also within that blog post there's a link to get some of our really amazing free cinematic LUTs. So there you go, that was a super quick video on how to get the cinematic black bars. So let me know in the comments section below, did this help you? I know it's an absolutely simple video, but once you know how, it's super, super easy. Now remember, if you wanna learn more about the cinematic look, including what settings to get onto your camera, uh, there's even some free LUTs in this series, so if you wanna check that out, uh, check out the link up here or the description in the video, and you can watch the entire playlist from the start. So thanks for watching, and remember, hit that subscribe, hit that notification bell, and you'll be notified when we release our next cinematic video. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.